Tiffany's Health Connection. This is my very first video. And what I'm gonna share with you guys today is three drinks that I make on a consistent basis. This is one of them. And those three drinks are my favorite. This one right now, what we're getting ready to do today is it's the Hawk. And the reason it's the Hawk is because it's green. And the reason it's called the Hawk is because it's one, it's green, and because two, if you're gonna be feeding this to your kids, you want to let them know, you want to give it a name to make them like what they're drinking just a little bit more than just a regular, this is a healthy drink. So we're going to call this one the Hawk. And the reason that it's going to be green, because you can do one of two things in this drink. You can do the parsley, or you can do spinach, or you can actually do both. And this is how you can sneak in all these type of vegetables in one thing and one drink for your kids. And this is actually something that you can have for breakfast and they have a lot of vitamin C and a lot of good stuff in here for them. So how are we gonna start with a lemon? We have lemon right here. This really gives it a very unique taste. This is rosemary. You can do the apple. I prefer the Granny Smith apple. Right here we have apple chopped up. We have the parsley and we have beets. I'm a big fan and I believe in roots. If it has a root to it and it came from the earth, it root is the closest thing to the earth. So that lets you know just how great a root is. And every drink that I have, I have to add some type of a root. If it's ginger root, turmeric root, beet root, I don't care. But if I, have, if I make a drink and I consider it healthy, just mentally in my mind, it has to have a type of root in it, and it has to have something that's green in it as well. And I mean really green, not just this type of green. But anyway, we're gonna move on. This right here is just for decoration. So what I do with this, I just buy this frozen. I always keep a bag of frozen cranberries, it's berries, it's whatever. Just go to the frozen section, get you a bag of frozen vegetables, I mean frozen fruit. So here we have it. This is all that goes into this drink. You can mix and match it however you want, but one thing you must have, you must have this root, this uh, beet. I love beets. Beets give everything an amazing flavor. So we're gonna drop this lemon in. We're gonna get started with the lemon, apple, parsley or spinach, whatever you prefer. I love beef. Just want to add some water to it. Now, if you are just starting out on this health food thing, I don't want to shock your system here. Because healthy food actually takes a second to get used to or whatever. So you have to slowly wean yourself off of sugar and really sweet flavorful things. What I have here, and you can use anything that you want, but I love, cause I, I like the flavor of watermelon. You can do one of these little single flavorful uh, water enhancements right here. You can use any kind, you can get the liquid, you can get the powder. This is my favorite. I absolutely love the J Jolly Rancher watermelon. You put this in anything and it makes it taste good. And I actually don't even use the whole thing. So you can just even use just half of this and you're good. So there we go. We have everything and in there. And let's go ahead and so everything is one thing. One thing I love about whenever you make these drinks, you do not have to liquefy it. You don't have to blend it all the way. It is nothing wrong with having chunks and taste and all this stuff individually. We're gonna pour this in here. And to top it off, you take your berries, your frozen berries. And one thing that I also like to add, which is separate, you're not gonna get these frozen, is cranberries. I love to, I love to put, I love the cranberries because they're gonna float to the top, but I also love adding pomegranate. Pomegranate is good for you as well, but pomegranate is so good. So we mix that in there. And this is just a little small portion, but I'm telling you right now, this looks so good and it tastes delicious. All right, so here's our finished product. Now is where you wanna add your fresh rosemary in there. 
And we're gonna pour ourselves a glass right here. There we go. This is your finished product. So good. Delicious. You gotta give it a try. And let me know how you like it down in the comments, please. And please subscribe.